All right, this is your import sheet that is in front of you at the moment. So it's pretty self-explanatory. You've got your title, which is here. You've got your category of your product. You've got the code you'd like to use. You've got the short description, long description, regular price, sale price, product tags, and an image URL. So your title will be your product title. I've just put king bed. Your category would be bed in or beds or bedroom, whatever you'd want it to be. Your SQ code is kind of a barcode. I like to advise clients to use the SQ code either as a barcode that you've got in your system or simply just uh, the product title. Your short description for a king bed would be, this is a lovely, comfortable uh, king side bed that supports your spine. In the long description, that's where you're going to detail. It is a king side bed made with fabric that supports your spine, that, um, and you go into a lot more detail on it. This is your regular price. I've just put it there, 625. This is your sale price. If you don't have it in, if it's not on sale, don't put zero in like this, please, because what will happen is, is the system is gonna turn around and put the price as zero. It will overwrite the regular price and put it as zero because there's a quantity in there. If your product is not on sale, leave this column blank. Your tags, what you'll do is, is that your tags will always con uh, contain your product title. Then you're gonna go comma, space, CJ, bedding and lounge, comma, bedding. If, for example, this is a couch, then you would, you would take it back and you would go couch, just like that. All right, so that is your, that is your product tags. They help for keywords. Okay, so now this is your product URL. So that I will give you access to the site so currently this is just a placement image that i put up in there at the moment so now what we're doing is is that you would open up wordpress so we'll log out of this one here sorry let's just log out we'll close this one here okay so i will send you the login link during uh in an email so what will happen is is that you would simply log in you'll be presented with your dashboard. It will look a little bit different because I'm gonna restrict your access just while I'm developing the site. Once the site is finished, then you will get full access. So, but what you'll do is you'll come here, you're gonna go media, library. Now the image I used was your logo, which is that, okay. But let's upload a random image. So what I'll do is you're gonna go add new, select file, and we'll just upload this clock here. Now, let's say we're gonna use this clock. So we wait for it to be uploaded. This depends, uh, this relies on your internet speed. Mine's a little bit slow as we can see. Okay, there we go. So now, what you're gonna do is, is you're gonna click on this one, come down here and you're gonna copy the URL. See it says copy, then you're gonna come back and in this column here, which we'll delete, because this will be a new one, you are literally just going to go paste just like that all right that is all you have to do now that is one item when you come to add another one you would go let's call this one queen bed the title is the category is bed in queen bed just like this and that's all you have to do once you've got that uh, filled up, doesn't matter if you've got uh, 20, uh, 50, 100 items, doesn't matter, send it through to me and then I will import it. I will have the, the front end facial finishes ready by Monday and then I'll just be waiting for you. If you have any questions, please give me a buzz.